live. But Ocean said, talk to me, how big is your house? Mm. You can see, I'm a fairly large woman. Wow. So, he came in there. Hey, Sam said, okay, 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 I hear you, I hear you. He's back, going home. He goes, Sam, I've invited the Ocean to visit us. Please, please, let's work and, and make our house much, 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 much bigger. So he worked and they worked on beautifying the house. They fixed it, it must have been like several stadiums and like when they were done, they cooked different types of food. They put potfuls and potfuls and potfuls of food and they waited. So Sun rushed and said, Ocean, said Long in, come on over. And she came whoosh, whoosh over the dunes, over the hills, over the mountains, swapping forests, climbing getting closer and closer to the center of the African continent, swallowing everything in her path. And finally, the sun, the moon, and the stars hovering, waiting for the visitor. And they saw her, whoosh, whoosh, she was swallowing everything in her path. And the moon said, now, what about? I think we should give her food at the entrance. There's no way this house is big enough for that woman. <laughs> she's almost here, but she's still coming over there. <laughs> and the son said, oh, ah, yeah, that's disrespectful. Push his wife aside and smiled at a very eager approach. And the ocean got closer and closer. And the moon was furious. The moon went higher and said to the children, hey, assemble, let's go. And they went higher and higher in the sky. The ocean did not even notice the disruption. Went into the house, saw the potfuls of food. All of the children were just eating, filling everything with salt, spoiling all the taste, eating and eating and breaking it. And the walls, the walls, until everything was flat. The moon was gone. Up, up, higher and higher with the children. Oh, when they're out there, the star said, Mama, we love this place. It's so open. It's so welcoming. Why have we never come here before? We love it. Oh, but, but when is Father coming to, to, to join us? Is he not? Oh, I'm telling her no way, way. Don't tell me about that one. That's the first time the moon has referred to her husband as that one. Oh, and the children didn't know what to say. But they were loving this new place. What an adventure. They continued and continued. And finally, when they got tired, they lay down up there in those wonderful places, in the constellations up there. And when they fell asleep, the sun was following them, trying to compose love songs, love poems. Oh, God, so what was I doing? I loved my wife, followed and followed and followed for hours on end and couldn't find them. And he fell asleep. When he fell asleep, the moon, the star woke up. Just finished that. Continued, exploring up in the sky. They continued until finally they were tired and they fell asleep. Even the last little star that was looking back, checking out his father and following, that's what it's called, Ikweji. Was checking out finally, she got tired too, fell asleep. And the sun woke up looking for the children. It went on like this until we had day and night and day and night. Day belonged to the sun, night belonged to the moon and the stars. And it continued like this. They were not meeting, but a kind of love like that. Mm. Can you imagine it dying? Mm. Dying, like what do you mean? Mm. Uh, from time to time, they had to come together, we are born. Now, this is many, many years later. Whoa, I'm talking about um, centuries later. They decided to meet. They thought, but we have to be in a private space, because human beings are very invasive. So they had something called an echo. embrace and love and passion and then uh, the human beings couldn't see a thing and when they were done they went to hear different ways and the humans but oh, then, oh, yo, come on. One, one, one. Gone. <laughs> but the love continued and continued and they fought every living creature on earth in the ocean and everywhere you can imagine that love is their friend Wow.